today we are exploring this incredible abandoned chateau. Now this is very cool. Oh my God, look at this old fax machine. Wow, look at this old chair. Oh wow, now this is cool. Oh my God. guys welcome back to the channel and welcome to today's video now today i'm exploring an incredible abandoned chateau as you can see it's like a winter wonderland here they've had a lot of snow over the last couple of days but this place looks special let's go and check it out and see what we can find so just walking over to the property we've got lots of stuff around here which you can see we've got an old lamp there but even more interesting we've got a massive slide with a climbing frame look at that that is so cool and it looks even better covered in snow. It does look so lovely here. Now the house and all the buildings are over there. So we're gonna take a little walk through the garden, uh, try and find our way to it. And we've got a huge trampoline there. Again, completely covered in snow. They have had so much snow here. The roads are still quite slippery, so we need to be careful on those, but we're just walking up to the house now. So let's go and see if we can find a way in check it out because I think this is going to be a good one okay guys we are now at the main house and um, as you can see it's very difficult to get to completely overgrown and this weather really doesn't help but, um, that's actually really cool look there's um, something on there I don't know what it is it's all overgrown now you can't make out what it actually is but it's very very cool right let's go and take a look inside and see what we can find. Okay guys, we are now inside this incredible house. And the first thing we walk into is a mosaic tile floor, which is really nice. And it shows me straight away that this person, whoever owned this house had a lot of money. This is a very big property. I've got the radiators there. All the cobwebs around the windows too. God, it's absolutely freezing in here. There's quite a lot of stuff scattered around the floor. Looks like we've got some more bed frames here. I'm not sure what this was here. This looks very interesting. I wonder if that was some kind of like a heating system, maybe. I don't know. If any of you guys know what that is, please pop it in the comments below. I know we've got a wow out there. Oh, I wonder if we can... No, we can't. Oh, I'd like to have a look at that later. And we've got another building out there too. So we need to go and check those out in a bit. Got a date on this. June, July, doesn't say the year. Looks quite old though, very faded. These are nice. These are really nice actually. I'm surprised I never took those with them. There's a matching pair there. Oh, look at the old fax machine, that's cool. God, that's very old. Covered in spider webs too. Okay, let's uh, move on. Oh, it looks very cool in there, look. But we have got a door here, so we're going here first. Oh, we've got a bathroom here, okay. Again, everything is in here, look. A toilet cleaner, even the soap is still on the dish. Although the taps are missing. In fact, all the taps are missing, so maybe they took those when they left. Maybe they were quite expensive. It wouldn't surprise me, to be honest. So this was, oh wow, it's a very, very rich house, you can tell it is. Is there anything in here? Yeah, see, there's still quite a bit of stuff in here too. Got the old toothbrushes in there, some more soap, 
towels. In fact, there's a brand new soap there. It hasn't even been used, look. Anything up there? No, they're empty, I think. Yeah, they're both empty. Okay, let's um go into the main, is this the lounge area? Oh, look at these. These are incredible, very expensive as well. Wow. So again, I'm very surprised I never took them, but maybe because they were so big. Uh, we've got loads in here. Is there anything in here, I wonder? Oh, there is. Just some odds and sods, nothing of real interest. Unless there's still something in there, which there isn't. <laughs> That's really cool, look at that. It's all made of shells. Wow. That's really cool, I like that. This chair's nice as well, look at that. Look at the detail on that chair. There's a real lever too, poor, but that's worth quite a bit of money. Again, a shame it's been left here. Look at the floor. And the rugs as well. Those rugs must be worth an absolute fortune. Really do like these. Really nice. Now, I can't help but notice the um, the Garfields on the top of the fireplace here. <laughs> They're really cool. What's that there? That's another Garfield thing. 1997. Looks like we've got some birds nesting in the fireplace. Again, we've got loads of furniture here. I can't believe it's all been left. Not a lot in there. Is there anything in there? Oh, we've got some VHS tapes in here. Indiana Jones, brilliant film that. <laughs> Pavarotti. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting selection. Wow. So we've got a few more that have been left on the display cabinet here. Beauty and the Beast, Peter Pan. Again, we've got loads of stuff left in here, look. So every drawer has got something in it. They must have just gone through it and just taken out the stuff that they wanted. We've got a peek outside the window here. You can see how snowy it is outside. Absolutely freezing. Even in here, it's still very, very cold. Right, let's go and check out this door here and see where that goes and then we'll go upstairs. Okay, let's have a look through here and see where this goes. Ah, we've got a kitchen here. And that looks very interesting. I'll have a look at that in a minute. Look at all this stuff that's been left here. Oh, look, we've got some footprints on there. Maybe the local fox has found a way in. Is this marble? Is this real marble? I think it is. Yeah, it is. It actually is. Real marble worktops and backing boards. We've got an oven here. I'm getting like a, like a 90s feel from this place. Oh, dearie me. They didn't know how to clean the microwave. That's disgusting. <laughs> so we've got some big radiators which have been taken off the wall here. Again, we've got loads of stuff that's been left on the side here. But um, nothing of real interest. So we've got the fridge there. Luckily, there's nothing in it. I think maybe all these cupboards are probably empty. Yeah, they are. But that's cool. I like that. Is that real leather? Yeah. Now, this looks very interesting. I think I know what this is. Yeah, it is. It's a basement. Now... Oh my God, that is scary. Ugh. Okay, it is absolutely flooded down there. I don't think I'm gonna, look at all the water running off of that. My God. Um, yeah, it is completely flooded. In fact, there's about a foot of water down there. Oh my God. I might just leave that open for a little bit. Just let it air out. 
Um, let's go and have a look through here and see what we can find in here. So this looks like the conservatory. Oh my God, look at this. This is beautiful. Oh wow, look at the pictures. Okay, they are pretty special. They are very special. What's that? Oh, sounds like local road workers. Blimey, these could have been the people that used to live here. It's a shame they never took these with them. Real shame. Got a lovely fireplace here. In fact, this whole conservatory is just stunning to look at. It really is. It must have cost a fortune to build. Now, I did for a minute think these were real flowers, but they're not. They're all plastic. So, um, yeah, it's hard to tell how long they've been here for. I mean, look at them. They are absolutely covered in spiderwebs. So they've obviously been there for a very long time. Wow. That fireplace is really lovely. You can almost imagine it. When this house was lived in, you imagine the fire burning away and they're now sat on a lovely sofa looking out at that view with all that snow outside. It's a shame it's not being lived in now because it is a beautiful property. Again, we've got this massive, like, deep hole around the side here. I don't know if that is some kind of um, heating system, maybe. I think what it probably had was pipe work, which ran along. And um, obviously, you've got the vents here where the heat came up from below. This table looks interesting. Looks like a solid oak. And we have got a building out there as well, I have noticed. We'll go and have a look out there in a minute. But... Um, that one looks like it's got like a, I don't know, like a little swimming pool or a jacuzzi or something in it. That looks pretty cool. So um, what we'll do, guys, we'll um, shut the basement door and then we'll go and have a look upstairs and see what we can find up there. Oh, my God. That, that was very close. That was very close. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. That would have made a horrible noise if that had fallen over. Luckily I saved it. Right, okay, let's go and have a look upstairs. Okay guys, we're gonna have a quick look upstairs now and see what we can find up there. Again, we've got loads of spider webs on the staircase walking up here, even on the banisters as well. Look at this carpet, oh my God. Very bougie, very, I don't know. Ooh, what was that? That's creepy. It's absolutely freezing in here, but it is beautiful. Look at the design work in here. And look at that. That is absolutely massive. What is that noise? Is that something in there? No, it's the butterfly up there, look. I don't know if you can hear that on the camera, but get a bit closer. It actually sounded like there was someone in that cupboard then. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that actually freaked me out a little bit. Let's just make sure there isn't anyone in there. No. God, this is stunning. I can understand why they left this because it is just so big, but it is beautiful. And it's still in stunning condition as well. Wow. Oh, we've got some creepy dolls on the windowsill there, look. Oh, dearie me, what has happened to those? God, look at it outside, guys. It is so beautiful today. But I did read minus seven on the car before I came in here, so very, very cold. Okay, so we've got the ensuite here. God, look at that. Massive bath. Twin basins, shower in the corner. Again, all the taps have been taken away, so I can only imagine that these were very expensive taps and they just had to be you know, taken, basically. It's a shame, because we'll never know what they look like, but probably some sort of like gold-plated ones or something, I don't know. We've got a, a toilet in there. Ooh, a little bit grim. Okay, so we have got another door just over here, and I don't know what this is. This could be like a cupboard or something, maybe. Oh, 
Oh my God, no, it's a... Oh, they've got a sunbed as well. Well, this was definitely um, the wife's room, 100%. My God, look how old these are. Oh my goodness me, that is so cool. Look how much it's faded as well. Is that smoke damage on there? It could be. It does look it. I mean, this sunbed must have cost a fortune back in its day. Don't know if any of you guys know how much these are, or were to buy back in the day, but I reckon it'd probably still work to be honest. But again, such a big, heavy thing, you know, and it's outdated now, so probably no use to anyone. But I don't know, there might be someone out there who wants it. And we've got a, a beauty bed there as well for the massages and things. So yeah, quite a cool little room, that. Nice little find. Okay, guys, so we've got another building here we're gonna have to take a look in. And again, it is full up. Every single room has got something in it. Look at this, we've got a bed in here. We've got wardrobes, we've got a huge sink or a basin. Look at that. Oh, they're nice, the little uh, book stops. They're very cool. Looks like we've got the three wise men in here too. We've got two on the windowsill there and then one there. <laughs> very strange. I have seen a little bit of Christmas decorations around actually. I don't know why. Oh, that's cool. wonder where that is. Looks very nice. Interesting ceiling in here. See the RSJs in between the brickwork. That's very cool. So we've got, I think there's a bathroom in here. And again, look, everything is in here. Looks like someone's done an emergency number two in there. That is not very nice. We won't go and look at that. But yeah, more Christmas stuff. There's a few bits left in here too, look. Oh, hello. <laughs> and I think we've got another room just here. This looks like it could have been another bedroom, maybe. Yeah, I think it was. And again, there's still loads of stuff in here too. Look at these, look, these are jigsaw puzzles. These are actually jigsaw puzzles that someone's made, put together and then framed them. It's really, really cool. Oh, we've got some basset hounds here. I used to have a basset hound called Betsy. Beautiful dogs they are. Wow, look at the spider webs on this windowsill. Incredible. Again, this is a very, very nice little building. It's a shame it's been left. I mean, you could buy the main property and then rent these out as B&Bs or something. You know, how lovely would they be? It's just a waste. Let's go see what else we can find. So we've got another one. This looks like it could be exactly the same as the one we've just been in. And again, it doesn't disappoint, guys. Look at the amount of stuff that's been left in here. This is crazy. Wow, look, even those scales look like they were gold plated. <laughs> We've got some trophies here. Oh my God, 1986. Wow. 1975 up to 1982. That's amazing. We've got Garfield again. <laughs> Wow. I mean, even that, look at that wardrobe there. That must have cost an absolute fortune. And it's just sat here now, rotting away. What a shame. Now that is a very big basin. That is a huge basin. Oh, guys, look at this. This is cool. This is very cool. Wow. This is actually really, really nice. Still got the toothbrushes there. And we've even still got the soap as well. Look at that. Look how mouldy that's gone. Wow. And the world's tiniest bath. That is absolutely dinky. God, you couldn't sit down in that, could you really? It's so small. Unless it was for kids, I don't know. Maybe this was the, the children's area. Okay, so we've got another little room here. Ah, uh, no, this wardrobe has um, definitely seen better days. What a shame. It's 
not as much stuff in this one. The table and the chairs set up over there still. You can hear the cars driving past because we're right next to the main road now. Oh no, it's a shame, look at that. What a waste, absolute waste. Oh well. Okay, so I'm now at the jacuzzi. I didn't know what this was when I was in the house, but it is a jacuzzi. Massive building. Guys, look at this. How incredible to have one of these in your own house. Even the building, the building still looks in really good condition. But my goodness me, this is so cool. You can see it's been empty for a long time. No one's been in that for years. And it is such a shame. This building, this whole property, has just blown me away, it really has. Wow, okay, let's move on. Okay guys, this is the last building to look in now and it is the biggest and look at, the, oh my God, no way. Oh my God, this is incredible. Wow, I had absolutely no idea this was in here, look at it. Oh, that is so beautiful. Wow, honestly, that is really, really cool. What a shame it's been left here like this. Has it still got the bells on too? Look, it has. Oh, you can just imagine that going down the road, can't you, with its owner in the back. Yeah, these people must have been so wealthy. I mean, the houses that are in this village, like around here, they are nowhere near the size of this property. These people were obviously very, very wealthy. Look at the decoration in here. It's absolutely stunning, it really is. And to find that in here, well, that's the perfect end of the video right there. Okay guys, so I was just walking around doing my pictures and then I came across another house which is part of this property. Now I think this is probably a granny annex. I cannot believe there are two houses on this property. Oh, there's a creepy basement as well. Oh my God, look at that. Look at that. That is absolutely stunning. Wow. Some old newspapers here, dated 1986. My goodness me. Wow, is that an old Singer sewing machine of some sort? It's a Singer and it does look like a sewing machine. If any of you guys know exactly what that is, please pop it in the comments below, I'd love to know. Um, oh, I've been here for so long, honestly guys, I'm just gonna have a quick run around this property and see what's in here. Loads of chairs in here, we've got another fireplace. We've got a downstairs bathroom. Very strange having that right next to what I think is the front door there. Yeah, there's the road, look, you can see the cars going past. Completely overgrown, completely overgrown. Let's have a quick look up here. Oh, the architecture in here again as well. Stunning, absolutely stunning. And to think this is just the granny annex of that massive place we've just looked around. A wood burner in the bedroom up here. This looks like it could have been a kid's room. Maybe not, maybe some sort of storeroom. Lovely bed. Very, very nice bed. This looks very nice too. Wow. Very, very expensive. And it's a shame it's been left, it really is. And we've got two more rooms. We've got another bedroom there. And then we've got another bedroom here. Very, very small, but I mean, what a bonus, you know, to find this on the same property that I've just filmed. Absolutely incredible. Okay, now I'm gonna have to run around and do my Instagram stories and TikTok videos again. But before we do, we have got a basement to look in. Now I'm in here completely on my own, so this is always a little bit, oh, kind of makes the hairs on the back of your neck go up. Ooh, just do it quickly. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh, it's actually really warm down here. That is really bizarre. It is really warm in here. Almost like the heating's been on. I, I don't even know why. Very strange. Maybe the building just holds the temperature. As soon as you come back up here, it's freezing. Absolutely freezing. Okay, right, that's that. 
Let's go and do some more pictures quickly. Well, this is definitely the property that keeps on giving. I have just found this tree house or outbuilding at the very bottom of the garden, but sadly, I don't think I can get into it because the stairs are so rotten. Even the building is starting to drop. I don't think I'm going to be able to get in there, guys. Look at that, it had its own electricity supply too. This looks like it could be one of the fence posts from the top. But, um, oh, this is just too dangerous. Honestly, it's just too dangerous. Um, yeah, sadly, I can't show you guys what's in there, but very cool. I thought I'd include it in the video as well, just to show you guys that, you know, how much this building has. It's not just one building. There's two houses here. You've got the barns, the outbuildings, and that as well. It's crazy, absolutely crazy. Well, that is it for today's video. I hope you've enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe. Please go and check out the Instagram, which is the Beard Explore underscore. Also go and check out the Facebook page. Like always, I put all the pictures on Facebook. Tend the best on Instagram. And I'll see you on next week's video.